Welcome to the planet Mobius, a world beyond what you know from the Sega games. 200 years from now, Silver the Hedgehog prepares to become a hero to his world and all of time. Patience, Apprentice. The energies of the Time Stone are vast and powerful. Just because you use them to travel through time does not mean you should tap into them too quickly or greedily. Fractured Mirror, Part 1 Through the Looking Glass This is why we practice. Like the Time Stone, you have incredible potential. If you delve too deeply into your power without preparation, I fear you will suffer the same fate as... Just a second, Master. I'm sensing something. What is that? Hmm. It appears we have a visitor from another time. Perhaps another dimension entirely. You mean they crossed from their zone to ours? People can do that? You've done it yourself, child. More than once. Such as your battles with Tekeos or Scourge in the Anti-Zone. Oh, I mean other people. None that I can recall. Or at least, more accurately, none still living. I'll find out who this mystery invader is. And if he's a threat, I'll handle it. Silver, wait! Uh, what? Uh, do you need me to stay with you? No. Investigate. But do not be so quick to find conflict. Remember my words on potential and restraint. Ultimate power ultimately corrupts. Don't worry, Master. I'll remember. And I'll be ready for anything! I'll check in with Edmund first. He might have sensed something, too. That, and weird stuff seems to be happening on Oinks Island all the time. My best bet is to start my search over there. Hmm... Could it be that the traitor from the Freedom Fighters past followed me here? <laughs> that will make things way simpler. Maybe for once, they'll be friendly uh Huh? No, of course not. But you won't get the drop of me twice! There! Show yourself! Vent! Uh, okay... I still have no idea who you are. Get it out! This could get ugly. Sonic the Hedgehog, 221 to 224. Get a front row seat. Subscribe today. Subscribe through ArchieComics.com or on your local comic book store. Let's choose!
should have stuck to the lasers. My turn, jerk! Now, then. Are you going to explain yourself? Or do I rock your world some more? That's right! Run! No, wait. I was questioning him. Blah. Get back here! Truce! I just want answers! I'll admit, I got a little carried away. All I want to know is... Uh, where did you go? Oh, come on! We already know who will win this fight! Thunder Arrow! Aha! Got you! Thought you can sneak up on me, did you? He did, you twerp. You're lucky that I've still got enough zip to watch your back. <laughs> I appreciate the help, sir. But did you see? Oh, you tore up what's uh, left of my city. City? Yes, yeah, Slipper. I did. Oof. But, but he started. Yeah, that's it. no excuse. You have the power. You should keep your friends in line if they want to rough house. But. <laughs> and now, look at me. I'm an old man, Slipper. I can't handle this much excitement. <sighs> well, aren't you going to explain yourself? Like I was trying to say. Don't shush, your elders. My master and I sensed this guy through the time stone. He was from another time and maybe a whole other dimension. I mean, zoned. I came to find out who he was and if he knew anything about him. And then this shiny fellow attacked you? Yes, sir. And you tore up my city. I protected myself. Do you recognize him? Or it? Hmm. No. Makes me think of my papa for some reason. Though. If my master is right, and it is from another zone, why would it travel so far just to pick a fight? You're too kind-hearted, Silver. You wouldn't understand. And so we conclude our first act to the Sonic Universe animated adaptation series. Will Silver be able to unlock the truth behind this mystery? Only time will tell. Master, I feel something coming our way. It appears we have a visitor from another time. Perhaps another dimension entirely. Huh. I wonder who or what it is that had entered into our world.